Portions of the day's programming are reproduced by means of electrical transcriptions or tape recordings. Good morning, Apple Valley, and welcome to this live edition of Eagle Eye on the Fly. I'm Ellen Roos. And I'm Ben Balio. Before we head out to break, we have one more show for all you good girls and boys. Let's start by clearing the ice for a team that's heating up the winter season. Here's Aaron Greer with more on the ice sets. We're here outside of AVHS's Ice Arena, home to some of District 196's finest, the ice sets. The ice sets are a District 196 figure skating team, and we uh, have skaters that are from Eastview High School, Egan High School, Apple Valley High School, and Rosemont High School. And we all come together and skate as one big team and we do competitions on behalf uh, representing the district. The ISS are judged in two main categories. Synchro, a team sport where skaters focus on precision and skill, and individual events where skaters can be judged on artistic expression or skill. We talked to Captain Elizabeth Carlson to see what's new with the team this year. Well, this year we got a lot of new skaters on the team, and so we've actually added off-ice also, and we have an off-ice coach who helps train us, and we have two new assistant coaches as well. The ice set season started in late November and lasts up until mid-March. After the team is finished with competitions, they will focus on practicing for their annual ice follies. The ice set's looking forward to another promising year. Reporter for Eagle Eye, I'm Aaron Greer. Thanks, Aaron. We wish the ice sets luck as they skate their way into 2008. Hey, Ellen, did you get all your holiday shopping done? No. The last time I was at the mall, it was so busy. I felt like I was in the hallway during passing time. Yeah, the hallway situation can be pretty frustrating. Katie Shuck can tell us more. It really makes me late for class. It makes me later for classes. With 2,000 kids in this building, sometimes kids get a little bit uptight. Obviously, hallway congestion is a problem for students since it affects them the most. Possible solutions provided by them are valuable. Maybe having some teachers like walk through the area and tell kids to go away and get onto their class. We stagger classes and the way that they are released. The administration, however, is still working hard to find a solution to help everyone. I suppose some of the solutions would be if we were enforcing constant movement and nobody gets to stand and visit, but I'm not sure that's the culture we want to have here at school. We probably need to get some kids and some teachers and some other adults to sit down and maybe they've got some better solutions than I have right this very minute. I think it's better to like look out for the whole student population instead of just a few people that want to talk. Without a solution in the near future, it looks bleak for hallways at ABHS. Reporting for Eagle Eye, I'm Katie Shutt. Thanks, Katie. Those halls are busy. Everyone, take it easy out there. Ellen, how are you going to get all your holiday shopping done if you're not going to go to the malls this year? Well, I was thinking I could have someone from the Science Olympiad team build me a robot or a car or something. Levi Miller can tell us more. Successful teams and activities are part of an honored tradition here at Apple Valley High School, and Science Olympiad is one of them. We asked advisor Ms. Michaels about the team's record. Oh, our teams have been wonderful due to the efforts of the students. They've um, gone to state every single year that the competition has been in existence. There are over 30 events in which students compete, ranging from forensics to airplanes to astronomy. Olympians study, drill, and build their way to the top, but it isn't always easy. Sometimes you find things that you don't know how to do, and you have to go do a lot of research to figure out how to get them done. Robot Ramble, one of the competition's technology events, is something Mark Albrecht has worked on for four years. I love Science Olympiad. Uh, I've learned a lot here in Science Olympiad. I've done some uh, amazing things that I thought that I couldn't do, um, like building a robot, for example. I never thought that I would uh, build a fully functional robot, but you know, I did. With calculations and tribulations, the team is looking forward to another great year of success in exploring the world of science. Reporting for Eagle Eye, I'm Levi Miller. Thanks, Levi. That's quite an impressive record for the team. Just as impressive as the number of ways that ABHS students and staff can share their holiday cheer. Here's the Valley View. Schöne Winterferien und ein glückliches neues Jahr.
Песо и Куэй и Куэйджо. А с праздником, дорогие друзья, и хорошего Рождества. For Halloween accent. Good feeling. Aquila Hera. Feliz Navidad. Sendanjie Kwaide. Eagle Eye would like to wish you guys all a happy holiday and have a happy new year.